Welcome to Deep Roots new series, Quick Understanding of Self-Driving Technology. I'm Yi Qi Cai. I'm in charge of the mapping and localization module at Deep Root. Deep Root self-driving vehicles are like human drivers. They can safely and reliably handle various complex scenarios thanks to our comprehensive and advanced self-driving system. In this video, I will explain what mapping and localizations are and how they work in a self-driving system. I will also share some highlights about DeepRoot's advanced mapping and localization technology. Mapping is one of the core modules of Level 4 self-driving technology. It replicates and builds models of the environment in which the vehicle is driving. Mapping technology does this by processing relatively static environmental information from the real world into a series of layers that are highly accurate, digital, semantic, and positionable. These layers allow the vehicle to better understand its surroundings at a static level, helping to solve the problem of understanding what is around the vehicle. Different layers present information from the real world in different dimensions. For example, the navigation applications that consumers use every day contain different layers, including a navigation layer and a satellite layer. Generally speaking, different layers are spatially aligned and share the same set of coordinates. The spot in the real world corresponds to the same coordinates in different layers, which means as long as the coordinates of a spot are known, engineers can search in different layers to get information from different dimensions. In a self-driving system, there are three typical types of map layers. Localization layer, semantic layer, and visualization layer. The localization layer contains environmental data needed by the localization algorithm. The semantic layer is a vectorized semantic navigation map that provides information to the perception and the planning module. The visualization layer contains a series of visualizations of intermediate results for engineers to check and review the map. The localization module provides the real-time position and attitude angle of a vehicle using data generated by multi-sensor fusion, which is combined with matching information from the map. Localization information solves the problem of understanding exactly where a vehicle is. In a self-driving system, localization accuracy has to be much higher than the navigation system we usually use for directions. Self-driving system can provide real-time location accuracy at the centimeter level and the attitude angle accuracy at the 1% radian. This high level of localization accuracy helps ensure the safety and reliability of the self-driving system. To sum up, the localization and the mapping module solves two problems. What static objects are around the vehicle and where the vehicle is, providing valuable location and attitude information for downstream modules. DeepRoot has a highly automated mapping system. It includes a series of mapping algorithms and data management tool chains. These algorithms include dynamic object removal, 3D reconstruction, and semantic map automatic generation. We also offer solutions for large-scale map storage, crowd-sourced data updates, version management, and map OTA updates through the set of tool chains. These solutions allow the map to be built much faster and refreshed more frequently. With our system, our customers can quickly launch self-driving vehicles in new regions. Our automated mapping system provides comprehensive technical support for launching and operating large-scale car fleets. DeepRoot's localization solution is about three times more accurate than general solutions. The higher the position accuracy, the more accurately a system can indicate what's around the vehicle and where the vehicle is to ensure a self-driving vehicle can safely navigate. Currently, the position accuracy required in the mainstream level 4 autonomous driving system is about 10 cm. However, DeepRoot localization solution can achieve an average accuracy of about 3.6 cm in the city center. In the framework of multi-sensor fusion, 
we have developed an architecture based on automatic sensor failure recognition. In this architecture, each localization sub-module is carefully compared with the multi-sensor fusion results. The pattern of each failing sub-module is detected and used accordingly by the sensor fusion stage. For LiDAR and the cameras, this means that some of the data gathered will be discarded due to environmental changes. For the GNS system, this means it will be re-initialized to the correct position based on the use feedback information. This all helps to greatly improve the system's reliability. Over the last century, position accuracy has significantly improved. This improvement follows a trajectory like Moore's law. Every 30 years, the position accuracy of automation system improves by an order of magnitude. The Nautic Sextant had the position accuracy of about 3 km in the 1900s. The radio backing had the position accuracy of about 500 meters during World War II. The first generation satellite navigation system, Cotransit, had a position accuracy of about 25 meters in the 1960s. And the GPS system introduced in the 1990s had a position accuracy of 1 meter. We believe that the 2020s will be the year of decimeter and centimeter level localization technologies. The current multi-sensor fusion solution has shown the possibility of this technology path. With the rapid decline in the cost of sensors and increased coverage for map, HD maps, demand will significantly grow for decimeter and centimeter level technologies. This level of extreme accuracy has been one of the biggest challenges for the self-driving industry and guides DeepRoot's mission to achieve safer, more reliable, and smarter driving experiences.